James thinks I'm falling in love with you. But he's wrong. I already have. So, you may get your mission to belittle, insult, and berate me every chance you get. And now I've given you enough ammo to tear me to shreds. So go ahead. I'm all yours. Fine. You stupid, waxed, thick-necked, muscle-headed, wiener-wearing man-whore. I love you, too. Did I just... Did I just hear you right? So what? You think I'm happy about it? You're smiling. Well, so are you. <laughs> you. I didn't even want to admit it. I didn't even know I felt this way until Bess made me face my feelings. God, she thinks that she knows everything. I told her she was mental, but she wouldn't shut up. God. Well, I finally copped to my feelings. She thinks that it's a big mistake that you and I are falling in love. Yeah, James said the same thing, too. Yeah? Do you think they're right? I don't care if it's a mistake. I can't stop how I feel about you. Well, me neither, and believe me, I've tried. Uh -huh. Bess keeps on saying that I'm temporary, that I'm not even a real person. God, I hate it when people say that. How can you not be a real person? I mean, look at you. You're crude, selfish, petty, and you got a mean streak a mile wide. Wow, you sure do know how to make a girl feel no, special. I, I mean, there's something about you. There's something about you, too. Bobby, every time I've made it out before, I've had to go back in and let Jessica take over, but... Time. You're still here, aren't you? They locked you up, they straightjacketed you, and they zapped you, and you're still here. You're not going anywhere, are you? No. No, I'm not. Every day. I never kissed a nun before. I've never kissed a girl in a padded cell before. Yeah. I thought you'd done it all. No, I think everything with you counts as uncharted territory. Come on, we gotta get you right here. Yeah, quickly before that seven-faced Pollyanna Vicky shows up and lets them zap me again. She says that she's given up trying, but I don't buy it. I gotta tell you, Bobby, when I was waking up from that electroshock therapy, I, I could feel Jessica trying to claw her way back. I don't think I could go through it again without her getting out. You won't have to. I've got a plan. Sister! S sister, come quick! Sister? Who is that? Um, Sister Roberta, Jessica Brennan, I think she's having a seizure. Come quick! I'll call What's the help? orderly. No, there's no time. We need to help her now. Come closer. I, I don't think she's breathing. Stay back. This one's a girl who cried wolf. Always claiming she needs help when she doesn't. What do you mean, you little? This is, uh, I'm, I'm really sorry about this, but we had no choice. Maybe you can find it in your heart to forgive us. Oh, please. Every other word in her mouth was fire, damn, or hell. Come on. Let me get you out of here. Sounds good to me. This is it. Okay. Listen, whatever happens next, it's the best guess. We're going to go through it together, though. That's all that matters. Oh! <laughs>